Hi, I'm Paul from Sound Devices. This video will give an overview of the main cool new features in version 8.2 for our Astral Wireless product range. We'll talk about the new over-the-air firmware update feature, frequency exclusion regions, our patent pending TV channel finder, a whip antenna length tool, a whole bunch of cool web app usability improvements, and support for expanded Nextlink coverage via multiple Astral outposts. Feel free to use the chapter markers throughout this video to skip ahead to any particular topic. There is also a page on our website that lists all the changes and improvements in version 8.2. Please be sure to take a look at everything 8.2 firmware has to offer. You can now update firmware for your transmitters in one step and crucially over the air. No SD card needed. No more cumbersome hooking up USB cables between the transmitter and the computer. This is a massive time saver and enables you to go off, relax and grab a coffee whilst your astral receiver manages the process for you. We've added support for Nextlink networks where multiple outposts can simultaneously and seamlessly control all of your transmitters with extended coverage. You've always had amazing range with Nextlink with or without an outpost, but now Place an outpost in the dressing room, place one at the far end of the venue, and you have command and control of your transmitters everywhere. Up to eight outposts can be added to the Nextlink control network. Let's talk about frequency exclusion regions. When auto assigning or manually assigning frequencies during frequency coordination, you can now exclude regions to prevent assigning frequencies to no-go areas, individual frequencies, or frequency ranges you know will be used for other purposes such as IEMs or IFB. Our new patent pending TV channel finder is an algorithm to auto detect and display TV channels to help you avoid inadvertently assigning frequencies within their 6, 7 or 8 MHz TV channel bandwidth. Grey regions represent TV channels with the channel numbers clearly overlaid. Introducing the WIP Antenna Length menu. Simply select your frequency range and the screen will show you the exact length to cut your antenna. No manual, no PDF, no guesswork. It's fast, accurate and always with you. We know it's not always easy to have the right info on hand when you're in the field. That's why we've built a smart new tool right into every astral receiver. Need more antennas? Reach out to your local Sound Devices partner to grab packs of ready-to-cut WIP antennas. Let's take a look at the many web app improvements which are sure to improve your experience during production. The RTSA just got an upgrade. You can now see each receiver channel's queue. And in a first for any RTSA, we've added our patent pending audio meters per channel. So you don't have to jump between RX views and the RTSA anymore. And if you roll your mouse over the meters, a compact control panel automatically appears, allowing you to toggle your transmitter's power, RF and mute, all without leaving the RTSA view. You may find yourself now spending the majority of the time in the RTSA view and switching less between tabs. Notice now that the RTSA shows transmitter names vertically to prevent clutter and names overlapping between neighboring transmitters. You can now view eight channels in a single row, reducing the need for vertical scrolling. Easily switch between the four channel and eight channel per row layouts. We've also enhanced the expand and collapse functionality for RX channel rows. We've enhanced the receiver channel view with new RSSI level and duration scales in the RF history. Need a different time span? Just click the duration scale to adjust it in real time. Antenna A and B labeling is now much clearer on the RSSI meter bars. And the best part, the RF history view now remembers its place, even when you jump to other screens. Need to juggle multiple transmitters on one receive channel? A new menu streamlines the switch and make sure that only one transmitter is active so signals don't interfere with one another. Need to edit frequencies quickly? Now you can type them in directly from your keyboard, even from the home tab.
And finally, the RF antenna mode map now features a refreshed, more intuitive design for better clarity and control. There's a lot more in version 8.2 we haven't covered here. For more information about this powerful update and to download version 8.2, please visit our website, sounddevices.com. Thanks for watching.